Are you tired of spending 5, 10, and even 15 minutes skipping around a method of joints example just to look for that one thing that's keeping you stuck right now? If yes, then you need a 2 minute summary of the most important steps. Let's dive in into 7 steps that are filled with power tips to save you time. Step number 1. Draw a free body diagram of the truss structure. Power tip 1. Write down all of the unknown forces. This will make it easier to keep track of all of the calculations. Step number 2. Calculate the reaction forces at the truss supports. Step number 3. Select the joint. Power tip 2. Select the joint with only two members. This will make sure you can calculate all of the forces at the joint. Step number four, draw the free body diagram of the joint. Power tip three, draw all unknown forces away from the joint. You will finish the calculations faster. Power tip four, the forces in the free body diagram represent the forces acting on the joint. This helps not to get confused when the truss member is in tension versus compression. Step number five, solve for the unknown forces using the equilibrium equation. Power tip five, the truss member is in tension if the calculated force is positive and compression if the calculated force is negative. Step number six, select the next joint. Step number seven, Repeat steps 4 through 6 until all of the unknown axial forces are calculated. Power tip 6. Double check your calculations as you analyze each joint. This will save you from having to redo your calculations since all errors will carry over to future calculations. Watch this video to learn more about trust analysis.